Iran announces amnesty for thousands of prisoners involved in protests against the government. Head of Iran's judiciary, Ghulam Hussain Mohsini Ajay, has said thousands of people involved in protests have been pardoned. According to him, 20,000 people who allegedly participated in protests against the government have been extended amnesty. This announcement comes after a month when the state media in Iran reported that Iran's supreme leader, Ali Khamenei, would pardon thousands of prisoners arrested during the government's crackdown against massive protests. Protests in Iran began in September 2022, after the death of Hina Masa Amini in police custody, when she was arrested by the country's morality police for alleged non-compliance to the mandatory dress code. The public outrage against her death led to countrywide demonstrations and protests, prompting a harsh government response. A violent crackdown led to the death of over 500 protesters, and thousands were detained. The protests in Iran elicited a wave of support across the world, with rallies carried out in support with the protesters and women cutting their hair in a symbolic gesture to oppose the morality police's action. The announcement of amnesty comes as the protests have largely become silenced and the global attention has considerably reduced. While some analysts read this development as an olive branch extended by the ruling elite to placate public outrage and signals government's confidence. For others, this lull in protest is temporary, and as long as government is unwilling to undertake significant reforms to meet popular demands, such movements will continue to emerge to challenge the ruling elite and dominant government institutions. Monopoly over power by a minority political elite, a weak economy made worse by crippling international sanctions, and lack of freedom for women frequently pit the government against people, leading to greater disconnect between them. Political activism and movements have been a key feature in Iran's politics in recent decades. In 2009, the Green Movement was launched by thousands of protesters led by reformist Mir Hossein Musavi and fellow reformist candidate Mehdi Karoubi against alleged rigging of elections. In 2019, people took to streets against rising fuel prices. The popular discontent led to massive protests and a harsh government crackdown, which resulted in death of over a few hundred people, according to some estimates. I'm Osama Nizamani, and this was your Daily Dispatch.